What's up, Red Devils? My name is Mia Bell, and welcome to this week's episode of RDTV. Now, time for this week's sports segment with Mallory. What's up, Red Devils? I'm Mallory Parrish, and here's your sports for the week. Last Saturday, our varsity softball team won in their Sardis tournament. On Tuesday, both of our softball teams played against Auburn at home. Our JV came out victorious, winning 4-3, and our varsity came out victorious, winning 12-0 in the fourth inning. On Wednesday, our varsity baseball team played away at Smith Station, winning 4-3. Yesterday, they played a doubleheader against Smiths at home. Great job to all our Red Devil athletes for their success over the week. This year, Earth Day is Thursday, April 22nd. Let's learn some fun facts. So in the 1970s, Earth Day started, and after 52 years, the message is still the same do what you can to protect this earth planet that we live on and it's a day for us all to come together as a world and do its best for our planet uh, and some ways that you can do that is by recycling or growing your own food picking up litter so this earth day i encourage you to go outside and do something nice for mother earth the first earth day was classified in 1970 founded by senator gaylord nelson recycling is important because it reduces waste sent to landfills and properties it also conserves energy and natural resources. So let's make sure we recycle and pick up litter we see. This week's sports spotlight is baseball. My name is Landon Russell. I play third pitch. Our season's going pretty well. Uh, we're playing really good as a team. Uh, feeling pretty good about going in there. 24 to 8. Uh, probably Smith Station. Uh, we already beat Auburn, so, and this is like a big rival game for us, so it's kind of personal. Uh, I think we got a pretty good chance to make it in the playoffs. We, if to win our area, we got to win both games. But if we uh, split, then we just make it in the playoffs. So I feel like we got a pretty good chance. Really, just visualize, uh, visualize, and yeah, pretty much official. Now, time for some Earth Day trivia. New York, Spain. Who is Kentucky? New York. New York City. Boston, Massachusetts. America. The United States. Spain. The United States. The United States of America. The United States. Trees. Plants. Oxygen. Plants. The Amazon. Alaska. We love our Earth. Earth is the best. Our big Earth is clean it, clean it. A better Earth tomorrow. Uh, Earth Anthem. Earth Day, we rock, yeah. Wow. Ooh. Earth. Green? Green. Dirt. Invest in our planet. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. April 22nd. April 22nd. April 28th. The 22nd of April. April 22nd. On to everybody's favorite segment, What's Trending with Kaylee. What's up Red Devils? It's Kaylee coming back to you with another episode of What's Trending. Today we will be counting down the top five prom dresses for you to wear to your big night. Number five goes to off-shoulder dresses. Off-shoulder dresses are really elegant, but they're a little daring. These wide neckline dresses will expose your shoulders and give you a gorgeous look. Number four goes to open back dresses. These dresses instantly command attention. If you want to show a little skin for prom, go ahead and show your gorgeous back. For number three, we've got pastel prom dresses. These dresses are popular each year, but this coming season, it's no different. Pinks, greens, yellows, you name it. Number two goes to two-piece gowns. For two-piece gowns, they're really fun because you can mix and match the top and the bottom and nobody would be any the wiser. Finally, for number one, we've got glittery prom dresses. If you're going for a celebrity vibe for prom, these dresses are a must. As you walk in, the lights will bounce straight off you. That's all the time we've got, Red Devils. Have a good time at prom. I'll see you next time on another episode of What's Trending. 
prom will be held this Saturday. This year's theme is the night under the stars. Remember to have fun and be safe. And as always, have a great Red Devil Day. That's all we have for this week, Red Devils. As always, have a great, great, wait, that's Mr. McDonald, not me. <laughs>